Amongst the generations of the people living today, who is using ChatGPT? Is it the retired baby boomers of the world who are writing scripts for their kick-ass YouTube channel? Or is it a bunch of overworked college students using ChatGPT to hold down three knowledge working jobs all at once? Well, a recent survey and some other data can help us answer this question. Hi, I'm Prof C and I talk about technology and its impact on society and geopolitics. And today I want to talk about generational differences when it comes to AI adoption. Salesforce recently released a report where they conducted a survey of more than 4,000 people across the United States, the UK, Australia, and India. It's linked below. Salesforce's research indicates that generative AI users constitute a group of youthful, of young, self-assured super users who utilize the technology extensively and are confident about achieving proficiency using it. A substantial majority, 65% of these users, fall into the millennial or Gen Z categories, with 72% holding a job. This group is also optimistic about mastering generative AI or ChatGPT, as nearly 60% of the respondents say they were on their way to mastering generative AI technology. Digging a little deeper into the demographics, 70% of individuals from Gen Z engage with generative AI or ChatGPT technology, and over half of them, 52%, rely on it to aid in making enlightened decisions. The enthusiasm surrounding generative AI is not ebbing for this age group either. Instead, there's a rising trend in utilization with 52% of users knowing an uptick in their usage habits since their initial acquaintance with this technology. Where else can you see enthusiasm among college-age populations for generative AI? Well, in Google Trends. Search for ChatGPT-related materials decreased during the summer break, and Minecraft-related searches increased. Now that the fall semester has started, the trend has flipped. In contrast, the people who don't use generative AI or ChatGPT tend to be from older generations and exhibit a marked disengagement with this particular technology. They express a limited understanding of how it works and a skepticism regarding its influence. A notable 68% of this demographic belongs to the aged Gen X, aka Prof C, or baby boomer generations. A vast majority of non-users of generative AI at 88% find themselves unsure of how generative AI could affect their lives. Additionally, there's a significant portion who feel distant from this particular technology. 40% confess to a lack of adequate familiarity with it, and 32% perceive it to hold no utility for them. So the early adopters of generative AI technology tend to skew young. This is not surprising, and this matches exactly with my own experience, where my peers have not even tried it yet. Some of them barely use it, barely know what it is, and my students use it every day. The question is, will this technology actually reach a saturation point and everybody will be using it? Well, maybe when I'm in the ground. Again, if you have made it to the end of one of my videos, you are a member of an elite group of patient people. And for God's sakes, please subscribe.